I'm Kay Dyer. I started as a reporter on the Oklahoma City Times in 1959. I spent most of my years there at, on the Times as a reporter and later became a city editor of the Oklahoman and then back to the Times as city editor. When I arrived there, it was in the midst of a lot of civil rights activity in Oklahoma City. And one of my duties every Saturday morning was to go up to a church east of the office, which was downtown at that time, and uh, gather with the NAACP Youth Council, which prepared there to go to a sit-in at some downtown restaurant. Well, one time I was covering City Hall at the time, and I was on my way to the City Hall when the uh, kids got into a downtown restaurant that they'd always been banned from. And so my boss told me to check in on that on my way to the city hall, and I did. And uh, I couldn't get in. They'd locked, them, locked the door after the kids got in the restaurant. The restaurant people locked the door and wouldn't let anybody else in. Well, I happened to see the fire marshal who was there at the time, and uh, he was around. I followed him around to the back door of the restaurant and he was going in to tell them you can't lock all these people in. So I followed him in and spent the day inside with about 30 kids who were, we were all hungry. <laughs> and I had to, uh, I was using pay phone and they were giving me dimes to put in it to call back to the office and tell them what was going on. And finally, I, we ran out of dimes, and then the people at the restaurant unplugged the payphone. So there were, the office was sending folks down the street, and I would hold up a paper to the window to try to let them know what was going on inside. It was very calm. The kids were playing games and singing songs, things like that. Uh, at least several weeks later, it was the city council passed a a public accommodations ordinance which required that they let all the people eat wherever they wanted to. And that was part of the, uh, the uh, civil rights movement that I was involved in, just covering it. 